like some decent support in what seal Fibo. Let's move it to see if it's got the, the new uh, cleaner head on it. And um, I paid £95, that's £80 for the machine plus £15 shipping. Uh, this is all scuffed here, so I replaced that with a, put part, a spare part I had. I put a new brush bar on because it's in better condition, because I had a spare one. But what I didn't notice was, um, this is a, a very big problem with the hose, which I'll show you in a second. So, um, so this video then is to show you how to replace a hose on the DC40 or the DC40 Mark II. So what you want to do is you want to take the attachments off. Take the bin off, and then you take the wand off. I'll do my best to do it one-handed. Camera down. Then you have to press the button to release the wand. See which is that button there. You don't have to do it. You don't have to do that, but I find it easier, and it'd be easier to show on camera. So then you put your thumb through there. Squeeze down the red button while you pull up on the hose. And it should come off. I'll just put the camera down for two seconds. There we go. The reason why it was difficult is because that is a problem. So when you take it out to do the stairs, you can't do it because it just because, it, because that part's broken there. So it's got absolutely no suction. Wouldn't even take your finger. So you put your roller hose to the side, and then you get your new hose out of the box. See, brand new hose. I got this off Dyson. So I got this from Dyson for free because it's machines under warranty and they cover hoses. It's got that nice new hose smell. So you just very simply locate it, locate it in there. And then it'll click. It's a bit, it might be a bit stiff, but it should be okay. It's definitely the one for the Mark II because they know the serial number of the machine, which is located behind the bin. I'm just put the camera down again, sorry about this. So I hope you heard that click. A nice new hose there. And then where's the wand? So you get your wand, push it in, hold the red button while pushing down. So the machine had suction with the old hose, wasn't it just like that? But it didn't when it had the it didn't have suction when it when the hose was all pulled out. It did, that was a bit do it. No mind. Anyway, so um here you put your machine back together. As I say it's optional to do what I just do, like take a thing take those things that you can off, but I decided to do it because it just makes my life easier. So to prove, to prove it all works fine now, I'm just going to get the plug, which is a bit swift stiff, but I'll sort all that out after the video. So when I, when I went like that, I used the hose, it just didn't work with the old hose. So I turn it on. And then when you turn back in, you just push the red button in to get the one green in there. Then that should all be like that. 
So that's how to change a hair from the Dyson Disc 40. Thanks for watching, I'll see you guys in my next video.